How quickly can you potty train a puppy? If you're feeling frustrated, potty training doesn't have to overwhelm. Puppies give really subtle, quick warnings that they have to go potty. The split second they stop playing, eating, drinking water, they wake up. Those are some of the subtle signs that puppies use to tell you that they have to go potty. Pick your puppy up and carry them outside right away and have them go potty outside, not once, but twice. Because the first potty will be just a check potty and they won't really fully understand that they have to empty their bladder fully. But the second potty outside empties that bladder fully. After they go potty the first time outside, praise and play with them to let them know that they've been a good boy or girl. And give them treats too because every little puppy and big dog like Yeti loves treats. Their age in months equals about one hour of potty time. Which means if you get a puppy who's eight weeks old, that means that technically they can hold their potty for about two hours. However, we're not going to wait that amount of time to bring your puppy outside because they easily get distracted and they'll easily have a potty accident. And we'll go through that a little bit more in just a few moments. So be sure to keep watching. Puppies go potty immediately. Like the second they stop playing with something, they'll go potty, just like that. So what I started doing with Yeti is I would set a timer, like a real alarm type timer. Use whatever you have for an alarm. If it's a phone, a watch, kitchen timer, anything. Set it for a half hour. Once that timer goes off, bring your puppy outside, whether or not they need to go outside. Encourage them to go potty outside, not once, but twice. After they go the second time, you'll bring them back inside. Now, after they go potty the first time, of course, you'll praise them, give them treats, but then you'll wait until they go potty the second time and then do the same thing with the treats and the praise. As they get a little bit older over the next few weeks, and that half hour is just starting off when you first bring your puppy home about eight to 10 weeks. Then after about the 10 week mark, you'll set your timer then for 45 minutes and you'll slowly increase that time each week. 45 minutes to 50 minutes to an hour, so on and so forth. Now when you set your timer and the timer goes off, pick the puppy up, bring the puppy outside, your puppy will probably look at you like, mom, what are we doing out here? I don't have to go potty. So you'll tell your puppy, go potty. Make sure they go potty not once but twice for that full bladder empty. Otherwise, if you only let them go potty once outside, they'll come back in and what are they gonna do? Yeah, they're gonna go potty right away on your floor. So when they're outside, have them go potty twice. That first potty will be a quick potty. That's what I had always called a check pid. They're scoping out their location. They're like, okay, I have to go potty. Oh no, there's a squirrel. So they just get distracted right away and they go and check out that squirrel and then you think, oh, good, they've gone potty, I'm gonna bring them inside. And then you bring them inside and they go potty right away. Therefore, you're gonna wait until that second time they go potty outside. The first potty will be that check pid, as I call it. The second potty will be the full bladder empty. Give them lots of praise each time they go potty. Then once you get back inside the house, you're gonna set your timer for that half hour. And you'll play with your puppy. And if they happen to stop playing before that half hour mark hits, Get them outside right away because that's their cue that they need to go potty. Once your timer goes off, get them outside again. Establish some routines with your dog. Set specific meal times and bedtimes. We don't want them to wait the full time their bladders allow. Each month of age equals about one hour of potty holding time. So by the time they're three months old, they'll be able to hold their potty for about three hours of time. So this is especially important for overnight. If you get a new puppy and he's eight weeks old, you'll be able to let him sleep for two hours at a time in his crate. And then once that two hour time frame expires, you'll have to set your alarm each night for every two hours and wake up every two hours to bring your puppy outside. Then once they hit three months of age, they'll be fine for three hours of time. If your puppy does have an accident, don't scold them, don't be mad, because puppies do have accidents. On your alarm, just simply decrease the amount of time. So if you had gotten to 45 minutes and say they have an accident, like at 40 minutes, decrease that back to a half hour, just for a few days, and then see how they do with the half hour. Then increase it again up to the 45 minute mark. Now if you catch them in the act of going potty, you'll scold them and bring them outside right away. Now what I mean by scolding, a young puppy won't understand our language. 
So you'll growl at the puppy because they understand what growling means. After you've done the growl, you'll say no right away. Pick them up, bring them outside, have them go potty twice. Praise the moment they go potty that first time. Praise again the moment they go potty the second time. If you find an accident later on, don't be mad at your puppy because it'll just confuse him. And that confusion makes potty training more difficult. Simply and calmly clean the accident with an odor removing accident for dogs spray. And you can find those sprays in our links down below or you can go to your local pet store. During the time that you're potty training your puppy, be sure to keep a very close eye on your puppy. It's best if you're in the same room. And what I did with Yeti is I would put him on a leash and then I'd tie the leash around my waist. If you're in another room, place your puppy in a small confined space. You can gate off the kitchen or you can put your puppy in the laundry room and you can gate that room off. I've even gated them off in the entryway. Just make sure that it's a tile or a wood floor, not a carpeted floor because, oh goodness, <laughs> cleaning up potty accidents on carpeting is a bit tricky. Have your timer going for the 30 minutes. As they get older, you can increase that amount of time. For overnight and when you're not at home, you're going to use a crate. And I do have some crate training videos linked in our description below, so be sure to check those out. I had Yeti's crate in my bedroom, so when he would start whimpering, you know, if it was before that two hour mark, if he'd start whimpering, I knew to get him outside right away. And with a new puppy that's two months old, you're going to bring them outside once every two hours. Once they're three months old, every three hours. So that equals one hour for every month of age that they are. You're gonna get a lot of use out of that alarm clock. Now immediately upon you waking up or your puppy waking up, pick them up and carry them outside right away because they're gonna go potty like that. Don't let them stop for food or water. Have them go potty twice. And when they come back inside, of course you'll let them eat and drink some water. And then the moment they finish eating and drinking that water, you'll bring them outside again for two more potties. Some puppies get the potty training thing down really quickly. Others, it might take a while. And that a while can take up to a year. Now they won't be like like little puppies at a year old, like they just might have occasional accidents. Yeti would sometimes have accidents at six to eight months old just because I had completely gotten distracted and I forgot for a number of hours because I was working on something else. But that was my fault because I wasn't paying attention. Be consistent and patient with your puppy. Good praise, consistency, <laughs> Yeti and reward helps them learn faster. For crate training tips and tricks, be sure to check out this video. We'll bark at you next time. How quickly are you able to potty train your dog? <laughs> Sweetie, damn it, dog. Oh, crazy fuzz.